That large storm sweeping across the country, 10 reported tornadoes, nearly two feet of snow in some areas, and wind gusts topping 80 miles an hour. ABC's Rob Marciano is in Chicago this morning and starts us off. Good morning, Rob. Good morning, Robin. The winds have been howling all night long here in Chicago. The flags here along Michigan Avenue, for the most part, have been horizontal. We've had a 49-mile-an-hour wind gust at the airport, 53 miles an hour in West Chicago. Even the big Skyway Bridge, parts of it shut down due to flying debris. And that's just the wind. Already this storm whipping up snow and severe weather across the Midwest. Overnight, a massive storm system rattling more than 30 million people. Tornado forming. Wow. Tornadoes breaking out in the Midwest. Tornado warning. Tornado on the ground. Ten twisters reported in Iowa alone. Wow, look at that thing. One of them ripping through this farm. Sheet metal sent flying, landing on top of trees, flipping vehicles, big and small, one after another. And unleashing a string of lightning bolts. The storm stretching further east here in Illinois toppled electric poles spewing balls of fire. And down south, watch as high winds up to 70 miles per hour caused these power lines to clash, instantly bursting into flames. Three mile long walls of fire stampeding across Oklahoma, prompting urgent evacuations in at least seven towns, engulfing homes like this one. And winds here in Chicago and across the Great Lakes really expected to blow all day long, even by Windy City standards. Ginger, as you know, this storm is a big one. Yeah, it is big and it is widespread. Thank you, Rob. You can see aggressively that low pressure system spinning through the Great Lakes. The cold front ahead of it down into even West Virginia, Kentucky. It's going to keep moving to the north and east and with it will come some significant wind. That's why we see wind advisories from North Dakota to North Carolina all the way to western New York. I think the Great Lakes going to feel it worse today. You can see some of the wind gusts later this afternoon along the lakeshore in Michigan. 50 miles per hour at Grand Haven. Look at Buffalo up to 48. That blustery and I I mean, cold wind is going to come right here as we kick off the weekend.